Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on the Dribble Studios channel. Today we're going to be addressing some issues that may have you may have come across when making my physics engine for Scratch. Now this is you know uh, the second part of a multi-part series that I plan to move forward with. So the first issue you may have noticed is that if we disconnect this and set it up to uh, I don't know let's say it's y of a hundred, it will go higher than uh, 100 on the Y axis. Let me show you how to fix this. So the first thing we want to do is just if we put this back up here, stop the script, we want to disable uh, this bit here. So just drag that out, drag the momentum variable out, go to operators, uh, the division symbol up here, I'm going to drag that out, drag the momentum in and just type in two. So it will half the momentum. It should never go higher than what it would originally go to, which is good. We can reduce this, we could divide it by 1.5. So it bounce a little higher. Uh, if you divide it by one, it would just be the exact same as it was before and it would make no difference. If you did 1.1, there would be a minor difference. So you get the point. I'm just gonna keep it on two, to half the momentum. So that is the first issue. So continuing on, uh, what we need to do here is go to choose a sprite. I'm going to paint the sprite. So what we want to do is I'm going to rename the sprite. I'm going to call it uh, B underscore edge um, edge. The B just standing for bottom. Uh, and I'm going to set the coordinates. I'm going to head over to code. I'm going to head over to the events tab. When the green flag clicked, I'm going to go to looks. Scroll down to find set color effect to zero. Drag that in, click on color, change it to ghost, change the zero to 99 or 100. I'm going to do mine to 100. I don't know why I just got rid of it then. So now we'll click it. Z. It's invisible. Now we want to go back to the ball and instead of if touching edge, if touching B underscore edge, we head back to the edge, a bit to motion, and I'm just going to set to that thing there so it can't be moved. There we go. That is how you do that. So now it will bounce there. It won't bounce on the left side, the right side or the top. So if you did enjoy please do leave a like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next episode coming on for our physics engine on scratch. See you in the next one. Goodbye.